What's up, guys? So with Matt Reeves' Batman gaining some pretty decent traction, it's time to discuss its ties to the DCEU, or the lack thereof. <laughs> so as we know, Batfleck has dropped out of the role that was meant for him way back in the Batman vs. Superman days, which I thought would give us a Jason Todd story. But now, we've learned that Robert Pattinson has taken over as a Dark Knight. And I have theories. So it's been said that Joaquin Phoenix's Joker isn't tied into the DCEU. Well, that may be a lie. Let's look at how it could be. So the Joker is based in the 80s. In a recent interview, Batson let it slip about the involvement of Joaquin in the Batman movie. He quickly tried to retract it, of course, but it happened. So we know they may share a universe, which then puts the Batman's time frame in the 1990s with a young Batman in his 20s or so. This would line up with Batfleck's story in Batman vs Superman, where he is a weathered middle-aged Batman and a lot more brutal than he used to be. Maybe Pattinson's Batman becomes Batfleck as the years progress. But how does that help Leto's Joker though? Well how about this, Arthur Fleck is already pretty old going into his movie which, like I said, is in the 1980s. And it wouldn't add up because Leto's Joker looks young in modern time. So I think Leto may be a copycat Joker, or maybe even Fleck's son? Maybe Battinson kills Phoenix Joker in the Batman movie, and not only drives Batman to become darker, but it also inspires a new Joker to emerge. If they went with that damn Jason Todd idea that I keep harping on, it would give the film a big motive for this. Batman simply loses it after Joker kills Robin, and it pushes him over the edge. With that, I will say whatever comes up in The Batman, it will be an amazing film, regardless of the plot. So far we have Pattinson as Batman, Elsa Gonzalez as Catwoman, Jeffrey Wright as Gordon, and Jonah Hill as either the Penguin or the Riddler. And don't forget, Joaquin Phoenix's Joker comes out this October. Alright guys, that's all I got. See you later.